All right, what's up guys? Welcome back to another and a half video. It's going to be a short one, but there's a good reason for it. So, um, because I'm a lunatic and I like to change the rules halfway through or more than halfway through runs of games, uh, especially pseudo randomizers, I have come up with a pretty neat idea here. So, uh, addressing the Owen problem, okay? So Owen being who we randomed and having Galaxy stop and it being really, really busted, I obviously considered, you know, replacing him entirely, um, but I came up with a better idea, and I think you guys are going to like it. So, what I have done is I have recruited a new batch of level one generic characters, okay? Now, the names... Well, first of all, all the genders were randomized that I picked for them. And the names were also randomized from commenters on my birthday video. How about that? So, let's see if you ended up part of the new team here. Mooncross Warrior, you are a male squire. Shadow the Impure, female squire. Then we've got Black Omen, male squire. Trenton, male squire. And Chris Weed, Reed, female squire. So, these five characters right here, you guys, are going to be our new team, basically. So, what I'm going to do, and we're keeping these characters. I got rid of Parker and Kaplan, so the Y Griff and the the Gafgarion, right? I still have all of these characters. We still have a guest Beowulf who just will not go away, no matter what I do. Remove unit. Can't let you march out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so we have a guest Beowulf. But anyway. Um, so, what we're going to do, right, is I'm going to randomize the generic class that each of these characters can be, and the generic class's command, secondary command, that is going to be on. So the first is going to be the job, right, their base job that they have to stay as, right? The second role is going to be the uh, secondary command from another job right? So let's say, for example, Mooncross. We roll you, you end up being a time mage, right? As your base job that you have to stay as. Then we roll the second time, and you roll Geomancer, then you have to have Elemental. So you would be a time mage with Elemental as your second command. Make sense? So we're going to do that for all five of these characters, and then I'll explain afterward what, how we're going to use this team, all right? So first of all, it's time to randomize Mooncross Warrior. Let's see what we get. Boop, 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 boop. Also, so after all of these rolls and everything, and after we discern what classes we're going to be for each character, I'm going to off camera, off video, I'm actually going to train these guys up to get to those classes and to have those commands and to be a decent level like the rest of our characters. So anyway, let's just go ahead and get the randomizing done with here. So there are 19 jobs in the game. So what I'm going to do is do a random number generator between 1 and 19, and then we're going to do that a second time. I think what we'll do is we'll do everybody's base job all in a row, and then we'll go back to the beginning and we'll do everybody's secondary command. How's that sound? So, Mooncross Warriors first, 1 through 19. I have a reference for this, a list of all the, the jobs in a row. So, let's see what number we get. 11. So, 1, 2, 3. Okay, so, Mooncross Warrior, it would appear that your base class is going to be Geomancer. How about that? So, Geomancer is base. Let's check out who's next. Shadow the Impure. Alright, Shadow the Impure, who are you going to be? What class are you going to be? 18. So if we know Geomancer's 11. Ooh, okay, neat. Uh, Dancer, so how about that? So Shadow of the Impure, Dancer, nice, dude. That's gonna take a while to unlock, of course, but it is, it is a Dancer. So Shadow's Dancer. All right, who's next? Black Omen. Alright, Black Omen, you are going to be... 
two. Uh oh, I think that might be a chemist. <laughs> yeah, it's chemist. All right, base glass chemist. Got it. Can't win them all, but hey, chemists. I mean, if we buy a gun or two, be just fine. So, Roman chemist. All right, and then we've got Tretton. Okay. What are you gonna get? 19. 19 is. Oh crap, really? Why you gotta be difficult? <laughs> Trenton, damn it. So that's mime. That is basically mastering every class. Okay, well, there you have it. <laughs> um, Trenton is mime. Why do I do this to myself? Uh, okay. And finally, Chris Reed. Let's go ahead. Nine. Okay, what's nine? His Geomancer was 11, so minus two. Oracle. Okay. So, Oracle base class for Chris Reed. The randomizer giveth, the randomizer taketh away. Let me go ahead and put my plus signs in here after everybody so that I can keep track of what their second command is going to be. There we go. Alright, so back to the top. Mooncross Warrior, second command. Uh, secondary command. What class? 17? Did we already roll that one? Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. No, we did not. Uh, so that's... Uh, I don't want to do calculator, man. <laughs> I really don't want to do calculator. Alright, well, we don't have a choice now. Fine. So, Mooncross Warrior, you are a Geomancer with math skill. Neat. <laughs> do not expect good math from me when we do all those attacks, just so you know. Shadow of the Imperial. Okay, you're a dancer, but what is your secondary? What is... Hold on, what is 16? So, calculate... Ninja. Okay, so throw. Neat. Alright. So, Shadow Dancer plus throw. That's actually not too bad, man. Alright. Black Omen. Bam! Seven. Seven is... Monk! Okay, cool. So you're gonna have... Uh... Yeah. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? There we go. You're gonna have chemist skills and monk skills. So, puncher. Got it. And... Trenton with his damn having to be a mime shit. <laughs> What's the secondary ability on the mime? Didn't we just roll 16? Wait. No, wait. So mime is 19. Bard and dancer as one thing is 18. Calculator 17. Ninja 16. Wait, ninjas. Wait. Did I do this wrong? I think. No, 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 no. No, we did roll 16. Four, right? Because that's why, uh. That's why, um. That's why Shadow of the Imperial got throw. Let's do a different number. Five. One, two, three, four, five. White Mage. Okay, so Trenton, you are a mime with white magic. Okay, at least we got a healer in there. And then Chris Reed, our Oracle. Your secondary ability is 14. One, two, three. Summoner. Okay, sweet. So, Oracle plus Summon Magic. Those aren't bad skills there. I kind of feel like, um... I don't know who who made out the best here, really, because, like, Dancer plus Throw is pretty good, so Shadow of the Imperial is looking alright. Um... Uh, let's see. Mime plus White Magic. Eh. 
chemist and punch art, just the ability to equip a gun is going to be okay. Geomancer and math skill, dude. What have you done, Mooncross? What have you done? You're forcing me to do math. <laughs> anyway, so, now that we know what everybody's going to be, we've got Mooncross Warrior as a Geomancer with math skill. We've got Shadow the Impure with, uh, as a Dancer with Throw. We have Black Omen as a Chemist with Punch Art. We have Trenton as a Mime with White Magic, and we have Chris Reed as an Oracle with Summon Magic. Okay, so the way we're going to do this, uh, when we actually go to play the game, after of course I go ahead and level these guys up and get them where they need to be and into the right classes, um, so for every map, uh, obviously Ramza is required, unless it's a random encounter. If it's a random encounter, we will be using just the uh, generic characters. Um, so what's going to happen is we are going to, for every map, we have to have Ramza, and then we're going to roll one uh, to see which special character we get to use in battle, right? So you've got Olin, you've got uh, Agrius, Ovelia, Zalbag, Beowulf, uh, oh, we should just piece you out, probably. Yeah, let's just piece Alicia out, sorry. Uh, we've got Lavian, and we've got Baco, right? Mastadio and Agrius, we don't really need either, but they can hang out for now. Um, so yeah. The special characters, we're only gonna get to have one, so I'll be running, rolling, uh, what is it, one through seven? Five? Six, seven? Yep, we'll run one through seven, and whichever one we get, that's the one we can use in that map battle. But it's always gonna be random for every single battle. Which is gonna be fun, because we could end up with, like, Ramza and Ovelia, and then have to use, obviously, the rest of the team has to be made up of our generics. So... Yeah, we will, uh, we will bounce around and use a bunch of different teams here. And, uh, if we get to the point where, you know, we want to re-roll what generic classes these guys should be again, we will do that too. But for right now, those are classes, that is the plan, and starting next episode is when we will have these characters up to those classes with their secondary skills and leveled up to about 28 to match Ramza. And we'll be starting from there with this plan going forward. Because it sounds fun to me. And because we've used pretty much every special character on this playthrough and haven't used any generics, why not use some generics, right? So, either way, thanks you guys for watching. I'm going to see you next time. As soon as I turn this off, I'm actually going to work on getting this done a little bit uh, before I probably go and take a nap because I've been up for a very long time today. Um, but, and then when I come back, we'll just see how everything goes. Thanks, everybody. See you next time. Peace.